All right. Hello, YouTubes. I'm Grimwit. This is Since a Cyberpunk Ghost Story. Uh, we've caught up back to the doctor's office, or rather, I should say, saved right before we died last time. Anyway, gonna do this for another mystery hour. I suspect we're getting pretty close to the end of the game, or at least past midway. Go ahead and kill the music. Jump on in. Now they have updated. We're now on version 1.01. .01. They said that they've picked, fixed a couple of bugs and a couple of game breaking issues within the, uh, the game system. I don't know what has changed and what hasn't. But we are here. Oh, okay, good. Um, also, I've picked up a couple of items. Oh, oh, oh no, I've forgotten how everything works. Okay, here we go. So, I don't remember where I picked up the, uh, no, no, I do remember picking up the fireworks somewhere. Right? Right? Anyway, point is, there's a couple of items that I'm pretty sure we can find fix like that staple remover over there let's see if we can open a certain box with that staple remover oh this is the wrong one now leave i think it's this box there we go it was shaking earlier tape was fused to the box and i can't open it with my hands maybe i can find something to cup with like a staple remover? Okay. Apparently, we cannot open the box with um, an iron pipe, nor a coin, nor a wok, which I think we should be able to, or a scoop, or a broken plate. We can't open it with a key, a staple remover. Has she lost even more clothing? Oh, well, uh, we actually have an option for that. Uh, she has daily wear. She has daily wear without a jacket, which I prefer. Maybe it's just because I like bare arms. Uh, she's got hurt with a jacket and hurt without a jacket. And that's what I've got selected here. Oh, God, I can't remember how to run. Okay, there we go. That's going to be handy when a ghost starts uh, chasing next. So, okay. I did a whole lot of backtracking to get back to this point where we can go upstairs to the doctor's office. I've already secured everything at the doctor's office. Oh, yeah, and birds. Uh, loud noise of flashing. How about fireworks? These fireworks could definitely do the trick. Plus, someone from the outside may see and call the police. I just hope that I don't accidentally start a fire. I hope you do. Birds are like, ah, fuck! There we go. No more birds. I don't know why I did that, but, I mean, here we are. These old fireworks could definitely do the tricks, plus some of the... Yeah, well... Uh, what? Oh. Um... Okay, I no longer have the fireworks. I no longer have the fireworks. There aren't any fireworks anymore. We, we don't have to do the fireworks anymore. I don't have any fireworks. Hey, do you guys like fireworks? I kind of love fireworks. I love the way they go boom and scare crows. Best thing ever. 
Anyway, let's see what's going on outside. Oh. Oh. This wall must have collapsed decades ago. I don't see anyone below, so I doubt there's any point in screaming. I mean, maybe there's somebody above. There's a point to screaming. Besides, something just isn't right with this building. Let's see what else is going on around here. A can of mechanical oil. This stuff is pretty useful. I suppose carrying it around isn't a bad idea. I'll just put it in my... My pot... Mm, my cup... Mm, my shoes. I will put it in my shoes. What's the description on this baby? A bundle of Joss... Wait, what? Okay, here we go. A can of G.A. Yao... Or, I'm sorry, Ga Yao Mechanical Oil. This is the same brand I use for my personal do-it-yourself projects. And it's here from over 100 years ago. Anyway. I wonder what else I can... Really? <laughs> so, I wonder what else I can do with all this stuff. Wow! I'm going to do that every time I pass through this room. So, what else can we solve here? I have a stapler. I don't know why I have a staple remover. Sorry. I've got two jade bagels. Uh, fireworks are known to scare away 200% of all ghost crows. Yeah, I guess so. I've got some offering and joss sticks. Also, some shoelaces. They're standard. They're in a cool neon purple. I remember that. It's been a week. Uh, let's see... Latex metal gloves. I'm having trouble remembering what the hell I'm supposed to do now. Although, the fireworks things, that started up... Oh, that's right. There's bullshit going on upstairs. That's right. There's bullshit going on upstairs. Ah! Why did the run not work? I wish there was just a run button. Oh, there is! Shit! <laughs> was there music last time? I think there was. It's coming from that room. Uh, elevator is stuck on the third floor. I'll figure out what's blocking it in time. Is that a picture of an eyeball? Cool. And what's going around hair? So, there's no way around it. We've got to deal with this. And I think the A button is how you not die. We have to press A to not die. And fortunately, I have, uh, I have saved recently. So, A, X, B, Y. So, cool. Ah! Press A not to die! Press Y not to die! <laughs> that was close. Who would set a trap like that? Why? I need to keep an eye out from now on. Besides the hair, this door doesn't seem to want to open. The doorknob feels broken. Things are getting pretty hairy around here. What was that? Another spirit? Ah, oh, let's find out. Oh no! Uh I've I've been trapped by hair. Um, am I dead? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> No chance, no nothing. Fuck you, you're dead. But, I mean, there's good news. Good news about this whole situation. We get to see fireworks again. You guys like fireworks? Ah! 
Hey, what up, crows? Let's use these fireworks for the crows. So yeah, the new update that came out, it took care of a couple of uh, game-breaking bugs that people were complaining about. Because there is no QA system. Oh, hey, fireworks. Also made it so that the menu was more usable, I think. Which I think is a good thing all around. I'm uh, I'm glad they've they're slowly figuring things out. Oh, that's right. I, there's a run button right there. All right, we got the can of oil. I wonder how many can of oils I'm getting here. Let's find out. Oh my goodness! One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I gotta get an even ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. You know what? I need eleven. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. What? Am I maxed out at ten? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Oh heck, let's just get a ton. Just just give me a second. Just give me a second. I need this. I need all of this oil. We're gonna need every single one of these. Trust me. It's perfect. Anyway, so like I was saying, they released a new update today. Um, or no, it was uh, a couple of days ago? Yeah, two days ago. And I'm glad that they did because there's a couple of issues uh, in this game that was really bugging me um, last time we were here. A lot of it was like the order of play, which I'm, I think is part of a design, more of a design flaw. Like in order to uh, collect the bottle, right? Like I can't get some items. Like, I can't get a plastic bottle unless I know I need it. But, I mean, I'm also getting some oil, right? And I don't know I need it. Or maybe I do and there's some something around here that will, uh, will we, we can use this oil on. I mean, obviously there's something around here that we can use this oil on. My point is, is maybe I've already seen it and I just don't remember it. Because otherwise, why would May be picking up this oil, right? <clears throat> Anyway, um, yeah, mm, that's some good oil. I don't know. I might, uh, I just might be overthinking this. Let's see if I can use the oil in the doctor's office. I don't remember anything spooky over on the other side of the building where you get caught up in hair and die. So maybe, maybe I'm just thinking of the doctor's office. So let's head, try that. Also, there is a puzzle, right? Oh, there we go. There is a puzzle to be figured out. Seven one five two, right? It should be seven, or is it four three six? Seven one five two is what I thought. That I, could, I cannot remember if I've tried this or not. Uh, not here. Seven one five two. Denied. That wasn't the right code in neon pink. Two, three, four, five, just Okay. Okay, it is six. 
I need to figure out the kind of too many wrong entries may lock the pen pad. I mean, that actually makes sense. It's usually like three before they lock the pen pad. So what could it be? Was it in fact... Hmm? Six one... No, I'm sorry. Three one six seven two four... Okay, that's where I got the um, the idea for the keypad answer before. Check drawer. Oh yeah, this. I can't push up my finger. Probably need what? 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 Since ACPGS has encountered an error and must close, a crash report named Crash 2020 19 blah 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 has been generated. These files can be sent to Suzuka for analysis. Would you like to open this folder now? Sure. Let's take a look at this error log. Hmm. Oh! Here's like the whole memory dump, just in case you need it. So the new update should fix some game-breaking bugs. Came out a couple of days ago. Yeah. Yeah. You, uh, you like that. Whoop, wrong button. <laughs> That's enough oil for Rockefeller. Yeah. Well, good news. Because I know you guys are fans. We get to see some fireworks again. There we go. If it does start a fire, she can just say that she didn't start the fire. It was already burning. It's like that when I got here. <clears throat> okay, I suspect getting like 50,000 uh, cans of oil may have had something to do with the, the crash. I don't know if that's true. Oh, hey, fireworks. But it is a possibility that I've got to uh, assume. Hey, Doom Lad, how you doing? Oh, hey, yeah, Doom Lad, would you like to see some fireworks here? Here, let's. Uh, here we go. Fireworks, Doom Lad. Fireworks, just, just tons of fireworks. Good game. Very cleanly made. A lot of good things about this game. It works too. It just works. Oh, hey, fireworks. Checkpoint reached. Good 
the music. All right, let's see. I got to remind myself what was in the doctor's office, right? Actually, we have a map. Let's take a quick look at that map. Hey, we can actually get out of the map now, too. They fixed that. Quick save. How to gameplay. Quick save. Wait a second. Do I have my videotapes on me? Yeah, I do. Huh. Uh, anyway. Map. We're on the fourth floor right now. So we can get to 403, which is, I believe... Hey, wait a second. There's like some kind of hidden entrance or some hidden passage or something. Let's see, that's a storage room. That's the big long oh. Dallas room. Uh, where Suk Yi is. I remember Suk Yi. Uh, let's see here. Just, just reminding myself. There's a salon. Okay. And there's a bubble floating by. Very nice. What? Get back in there. Okay, I've tried two of these codes and they weren't right. Three, one, six, seven, two, four. You know what? I don't think there is a missing book. Hang on. Let me take a look at something again. Ah, leave. So, first number, third number, and then fifth and sixth number. So three six two four. Did I try this already? Three six two four. I feel like I may have tried this last week. Nope, that's not it. Of course, we do have notes and stuff. So, it occurs to me, so there's a fan in the window that's been spinning, right? And there's a light on right over here. Now, this fan and this uh, display are 100 years old. So, in the course of 100 years, this fan has not seized up. And this light has never gone out. Right? I think this is where I got the gloves. That's why I'm in here. I don't know. I'm having some trouble figuring out uh, what's next. Maybe the fan and the lighter ghosts? You know. This is a cyberpunk ghost story. What's more cyber than ghost fans? It's pretty cyber. I don't know what the what the I don't know. I'm kind of at a loss here. I really don't want to look it up.
I don't see any special dates in here. Like maybe October 31st, 1976. Doesn't seem right though. Nothing's standing out here. Plus I got this oil. What am I gonna use the oil on? Okay. Let's take one more look over in, in Death Town. See you. We'll try to be careful. <laughs> uh oh. I pressed A to not die. Okay, that's just death over there, right? So I can't go any further that direction. Oh, okay. Sense a cyberpunk ghost story. It's a great game that has no bugs. So now that I have the oil, will this elevator actually make sense? No, it won't. I kind of want to go in there. But I'm not seeing an option for that. Get out of here, crows. Hey, you know what? I think it finally got rid of the... Yeah, it did. I no longer have the option to, uh, to throw firecrackers. Eh. Pretty sure I already got some oil from you. And once again, I suspect that that oil is the reason why there was a crash earlier. wonder what quick save means. Maybe that's for, like, lower, uh... Options, lower difficulties. Not sure. Was that bottle always there? Hmm. I know I still need a mirror, or half of a mirror, for this thing right here. So, the oil, oil is usually to get things unstuck, so what's stuck? Dodgeball. Wait, I got the dodgeball, why? A bouncy red ball, classic toy, this never goes out of style, even if violent games like dodgeball do. What? Huh? An old dodgeball. Oh no. I have another one. What is... Wait, did I just get another dodgeball? 
Yes, I have three dodgeballs now. I... Huh. Maybe I can use the dodgeball to open up the cardboard box? Lord knows nothing else will. Set up the dodgeball league with the ghouls. I like the way you think. You know what? A pin from that backpack would be able to open. Wait, what's this over here? Oh, nothing. Would be able to open that cardboard box. Or this, or a broken shard of from this glass right here. Or a broken shard from the window. Or a broken shard from the mirror that I've got in my pocket. Oh, that is right. I was I was headed towards the uh, scene of the crime to see what was going on over there. I like to imagine she's just skipping down the hallway, like she's got a red and yellow basket. Okay, we already know about that. What's Wait, what's in the kitchen? Blood and rust. Blood and rust. Large pa plastic bag with a rusted zipper. Hey! Well, it just so happens I have oil on me. Oh. What was that? Some kind of hallucination? That sounds about right. Oh, God. It's a body nearly mummified, and the smell is horrific, which is weird because it should be completely desiccated with no moisture whatsoever by this time. I can't explain it, but the eyes, ears, and tongue seem to be removed. No, that's normal decay. Oh, shit. Another one. Is, is this the person in the bag? So, the ten this tenant saw them too. What happened to him seems to be very different, almost personal. Ashes led with a trash can. Something's poking out of the ashes, though. Is that a tongue? So he cut out his tongue too. It's like he's been psychologically tortured. Wait, did I just grab the guy's tongue? Oh, I sure did. Hey, how you doing, buddy? Wooden statue feels like I got some kind of religious significance. Wait a minute. Seems to be a pair of human eyes stapled to the statue. Another vision? Use the staple remover. Sure. Why would somebody do this to themselves? Either way, I don't need a staple remover anymore. Even though I could use it to open a cardboard box. Did we miss our chance on the ears? Wait, 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 wait. There was a faucet. Maybe something in the garbage disposal. Check under the sink. Good thing I checked. The garbage disposal was turned on. Dun, dun, dun. I know your ways. Now reach in. I feel something squishy and wet. An eyeball. Maybe if I return what's missing. Okay, return eyeballs. Uh, maybe if I return this in case... Return tongue. Wait, where did I get the ear? Maybe return this missing. Return ear. Uh, return the other ear. Leave. Uh-oh. Ears were in the fish, not eyes. Oh, I just misread it. Okay.
Um, I can't move. I'm... Yeah, it's not letting me move. Are we in a cutscene? Is this what cutscenes are like? Buttons don't work. None of these buttons are working. Um... Oh! Oh, that's not working either. What about... Nope, escape isn't working either. There is no escape. Um... It's a good game! Let me just watch this guy for a second while I take a drink of water. Ah. Uh, nope. So, nothing from the controller. No keys from the keyboard. Okay, I can at least kind of get out. Let's just close this. Oh, I can't close it. Okay. Um, it's a good game. Let's try closing the window. So we know what our next goal is, right? So, good. All right. Well, the good news is, we have more firecrackers. There we go. And we love firecrackers here at Natch Evil Streams. Ah, it gets better every time I see it. Alright, let's grab some mechanical oil. Let's run across the building and try this one more time. Jump into this room because the floor ahead is pretty... Pretty messed up. Here we go. Exit hall. Go past the picture of the creepy guy that looks like an alien. And the pipes. Hop inside. Rusty zipper. Use oil. We have ghost visions through our cyber eyes. Nightmare eyes. Body nearly mummified, etc., etc. Suddenly a monster. Okay, let's grab this. First thing, we gotta check under the sink. And then we reach in after we check. Uh. Eyeballs. Wait, an, an eyeball? That might be where the problem is. Ashes for a tongue. I think I'm missing an eyeball. Okay, we got the tongue. Okay. Uh, let's see, there are ears. Yeah, you're right, it is ears stapled in there. There, no evil, see no evil. Let's use a staple remover. Get that. 
Hi. Oh. You know, I kind of want him to kill me to see what it would look like. So, while he's, like, having trouble scraping on over here, let's take a look at what these look like. I have one eyeball. That's where the problem is. We're missing an eye. Eyes because he saw the ghost. So ears because he heard the scream. Oh, it's probably in the pig head. Yep, does the eye belong here? I can't remove it with my hands. Maybe if I had a spoon or something, like a scoop. There we go, we'll just... So yeah, hear no evil, speak no evil, see no evil. That's what this is. Did he rip his own eyes out? Sure, wouldn't you? Alright, let's go ahead and return everything. Uh, here's all the pieces. There, now I can put uh, this spirit to rest, but an offering might help as well. Um, the arm moved on its own. Something shiny seems to be in the bag. Let's, uh, make an offering before we take the item. Please finally leave this place. Oh, that was easy. Now take object. Box cutter, the blade's intact, but rusted and weak. Um, yeah. Yes, we know. Examine chart. So, I thought there would be... Like, we just saw a ghost sitting here. I thought we might find out what's what's up with that. Is there a ghost on the patio now? Like a happy ghost? It doesn't seem that way. We know what the box cutter is for. So, let's go and box cutter us some box cutter. Oh. These cyber eyes are really useful for seeing ghosts. You know what? Everybody should have ghost seeing cyber eyes. I'm down with that. I like that idea. Let's do it. Let's sell cyber eyes that see ghosts. We can advertise them in the back of comic books. People will buy them. I know. I lived through the 90s. That shit was behind in the back of all comic books. It was, uh, you know, pre-internet day. Best advertisements were done in the back of magazines and... Okay. Oh, before we do this, let's... A standard box cutter with a re retractable blade. Unfortunately, years of rust and decay has probably left it with only one more use. Well, boy, do I have the use for it. Tape's fused to the box. I can't open it with my hands. Maybe I can find something to cut it with. Like a box cutter. Damn, the blade snapped off. The box has something heavy inside. There's a letter on top. Let's read the letter. It seems to be a letter sent from Meifu, Meifu, Hong Kong. I felt an intense pressure to return this to you. I could feel the worry in your last letter and knew... I must warn you again not to keep those dark spir spirits and demons sealed up in your home. Especially with your young niece living with you. Ah, okay. Now we know what's up with Suki. You must destroy them right away. If an evil is as strong as you speak of living in your building, then even the weakest spirits you have imprisoned will become dangerously powerful. Realign your, realign your chi and do your duty as my pupil as and as a daoshi. Sifu gao. Okay. I guess that went into journals? Yeah, it did. Okay, go. Cool. Uh, well, let's pick up the object. It's a large wooden piece of what looks like feng shui compass. If it's so important that someone should mail it here from old Hong Kong, then I should probably hang on to it. Oh, is that the second part of the mirror? I think it is. Large piece of some emblem. Hey, Gate R2. 
What? What? Uh, what happened to Gator One? Okay. So we've defeated uh, crows, ghosts, and the game's inability to function and made it this far. Perhaps this will get rid of most of the evil spirits. Place mirror parts. Something else is missing. There's something carved into the center. HG80. What the heck does that mean? Mm -hmm. uh, has to be something that makes sense here. HG80? What is it? Mercury? It's Mercury. Mm -hmm. Uh, there's a thermometer. Nope, I didn't get the thermometer. I had to get, like, enough oil to fund a Texas, but... It's a funky walk cycle. Yeah, I know, she's a bit top-heavy. Every woman here is a G-cup. Okay, I gotta take a look at that chart again, because now that we know we need to get an item, we can actually get the item. But I suspect I won't be able to pick up the uh, thermometer until I, uh, until I know Mercury is HG80. Examine chart. Cat, do you really need to rub up against my toes while I'm streaming? Really? Uh, Mercury, maybe something to do with an assignment. Hey, hey, there's a thermometer outside. It may have some HG80. Let's try and get it. The thermometer couldn't have gone far. I should look around for it. Ah, the thermometer must have rolled off and gotten caught on that nail. I need something long enough to reach it. There will also need to be some kind of hook at the end. Do I have any such thing like that? I mean, we could use the shoelace and uh, the iron pipe, which I'm pretty sure we threw away. Ah, okay, I don't have what I need here. But now I know that I know I need it, I can pick it up, whatever it is. What has a hook? Maybe I should use the dodgeball. Did I pick up the dodgeball yet in this playthrough? I did not. Let's go get a dodgeball. I'm trying to remember. You left a thermometer out in the porch? Yeah. Although you're a little bit behind, so that's okay. What has a hook at the end? Maybe we gotta backtrack to the, um, to the laundry room and get a uh, wire hanger. While I'm here, let's do two things. One, let's go ahead and put Suki back to rest again, again. And two, let's grab her dodgeball. Little ghost girls don't need dodgeballs. You know, I think those pictures of people outside are actually of Suki's family. There we go. We have another dodgeball. Do we want another dodgeball? We can get more. We can get like a hundred dodgeballs. It may cause the game to crash again, but I could get a hundred dodgeballs. I haven't saved. We'd have to do everything over again. Do you want me to get a hundred dodgeballs? I'm not hearing a no. One hundred dodgeballs. Maybe more. Only get 99. You think that'll keep it from crashing? I'll come back for it. So I need a hook. I think the next step is to go down to the laundry room. Nah, spooky mirror. Wait, did I just see something flash? Huh. 
Hate to say it, but it might actually have been my imagination. Down to the laundry room we go again. Yes, we do. Okay, this is a laundry room. There's got to be hangers or something. What's this? Oh, no, 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 no. Leave. I always want to keep one Betamax tape handy in case I really need it. Although, uh, you know, no, not yet, not yet. All these washing machines and no hangers. Explain yourself, game. This is a laundry mat. I've never seen a laundry mat that doesn't have hangers. Another gotcha coin, though. I don't know what it's for. And another one. Wait a second. Wait a second. Where are the gotcha coins? I have four. All right, chat, how many gotcha coins do we want? I think we can get as many as we want to put into our uh, uh, stocking purse. No, she doesn't have a purse. Coat, no, she no coat. Hair, bra, bra. As many as we can fit into our bra. That's a lot. Wait, there are hangers right over here. All right, you know, with that, I think it's time to end this episode. So, yeah. After these messages, we'll be right back. <laughs>